Hi, my name is Melissa Cole. I'm an artist in Spokane, Washington, um, and you're probably wondering why I like to create desert imagery when I live in the middle of the Pacific Northwest surrounded by pine trees and mountains. I actually studied zoology at Oregon State University and um, our field trips were in Arizona. So we spent a lot of time in the desert, Sonoran and Mojave deserts, and we always took a trip to the High Desert Museum in order to see the ecosystem from that area. I really fell in love with the desert, um, the plants and the birds and the animals, the ecology and um, how they ended up um, living in that sort of environment. I always thought that the plants, especially the different cactuses, were so whimsical and Dr. Seuss-like. I liked the shapes of the choyas and the barrel cactuses. I always wanted to bring them home to Oregon with me. Anyway, so that's one of the reasons I create desert imagery. I also worked in the um, Grand Canyon during my summers off from school. And um, I work doing a lot of big public works of art where I um, it, use glass and stones in mosaics working with children to do big um, sculptural pieces. So about a few years ago I started adding some of my glass accents to my paintings. Um, I usually work in acrylic on wood or canvas and so I add them to my wood pieces and a lot of times I actually get my work from um, the Tucson Gem and Mineral show and last year I went to the show to pick up some of the pieces that I like to use and I visited Wildmire Gallery and was lucky enough to become part of the gallery. And so I've been really having a great time creating desert imagery for the gallery. And these are some of the um, pieces that I've just created um, that I'll be shipping down there in just a few days. So some fun, whimsical rabbits. This one is a 30 by 30 piece called Barrel Racing and it's on canvas. Um, this one, is a really fun burrow piece and it is um, just a 12 by 12 but you can see it has the fused glass pieces in there and it's called you are my sunshine <clears throat> this is a nice piece called the rainbow connection and um, it features the gambles quail which is found um, in arizona and um, three barrel cactuses I really love working with different patterns and textures and so they're quite textural and fun to pet when you own your own painting you can do the petting. <clears throat> and then this is a bird not most people know but it's one of my favorites that I got to see the last time when I was in Tucson and um, it has fused glass pieces. It's the Phenopepla, and this one's called Phenopepla Frolic. It's a 20 by 24 acrylic on wood, and it's got fused glass pieces in it. Um, the Phenopepla birds with the interesting crests are found um, in the Ocotillos here, one of my favorite plants. Then I also do create sculptures. <clears throat> So I do sculptural work in both porcelain and stoneware. They're often quite whimsical. This one is um, a porcelain piece called Protector. It has a little woman down here um, in a striped pajama suit with a blue rabbit, her big guardian, over it. And so some of these pieces will be um, shipped down to Tucson and um, will be available in the Wild Meyer Gallery. And um, that's going to be found on their website, which is wildmeyer, W-I-L-D-E-M-E-Y-E-R.com. And thanks very much. I'll be looking forward to seeing you soon.